I should buy at 20, right? Correct or not? I've been watching it for so long. Half a year, I do all my homework, the QR, the AR, the boss, the sun, whoever, also I know already. The figure, fingertip. But I miss it. I would say that the five stages emotional change in what to be the high flyers okay so what normally we do is actually you know uh, today you all learn the fundamental you all have a watch list you all will actually you know uh, be an expert in choosing some of the stocks included, okay now i give an example yeah you have been watching stock a Okay, you have been watching it, you have been watching it, then what happened is actually at 20 ringgit here, you didn't buy because you are still watching. Okay, so what happened is actually you go up to the level of RM22. You are watching it and you watch all the way it goes, let it sit up. You didn't do anything because you are watching it. Right? Now, what kind of emotions you will have when you go from 20 ringgit to 22. The common retailers, what? They will feel what? Regret. I should buy at 20, right? Correct or not? I've been watching it for so long. Half a year, I do all my homework. The QR, the AR, the boss, the sun, whoever, also I know already. The figure, fingertip. But I miss it. Because I'm watching it, no tech action. You see, this is a common one, alright? Now, you're going to fail regret at this stage. Okay? Regret will be the one, the emotions that you're going to have. But you will just tell yourself, try to comfort yourself, saying that, no worry, because my watch list got one Agong list. Hey, please, uh, don't watch this uh, Agong list. Uh. <laughs> you know, Agong list very long, alright? Okay, so make it 5 to 10 watch list so that you're not really missing out. So you say that, no worry, I have an Agong list where I can monitor, so I try to monitor others. But deep in you, you will unconsciously go and click to see it again. Now, after one month, I can guarantee you're going to feel disappointed with yourself, right? You're going to bang wall, right? Uh, you're, going to, you're going to do something else that nobody wants to do. Right, you're going to hit your head, whatever, okay? I, I only can tell you that this is the regret that you're going to have after that you become disappointed. But you see, the funny thing is that when you go through all these emotions, there's one thing that you will never do. What? Take actions. You will not take actions one forever. Because in deep in you, if I don't buy at 20 ringgit, why should I buy at 24? Cannot go through its own psychological barrier. You see, that is a common one. What happened then is actually, you're not going to buy and it continues to go up. 26. You're going to be what? Angry. You see, when we don't put it in words, you never feel it. But when we put it in words, we show it to you, deep in your, in your subconscious, actually, you're going to absorb it. So that you're not, not going to repeat. That's why I say I insist to teach you how to buy high. Okay? Right? So after you're angry already, weird thing, we are still humans. We still don't click. Correct right, You will say, never mind, I still got Agong this. But you, deep in you, you are very, very, very angry with yourself, saying that why? I didn't click at 24 and get now it's 26. You will not take action on it. Honestly, I'll tell you that. Okay? Now. Wow. At 28 ringgit. I tell you, this is the one that going to be in you. You know you crazy until what stage or not? When anybody talk to you about stock A, uh, you're going to school the further. Don't talk to me about stock A. You know, this management bullshit one, cannot trusted one. Then you start to go where? You go to a forum, you start to write all the nonsense. Because you already start to be crazy. You 
you see. I don't know which of you do that. <laughs> but these are the stages that you're going to feel, yeah? You're going to feel. And the weird part is what? You're going to be what? You start to... to agree with it. And 30 ringgit lah. Hmm. I think the price is worth it. Your behaviour, your attitude changed 180. You start to persuade other people. That's where what? Ah, man, all the flat in front, what they do? <laughs> They're gonna all in. <laughs> you see, this is where, if you look at whatever our cycle of the big market is, this is where you're gonna be the high flyers. Right? These are the high flyers. You're gonna agree, you're gonna buy, and what happened is, it's going to go down all the way like that.